What's up everybody, welcome to Money Management channel. My name is Andrei and today I'm going to be doing an update on SoFi Ticker. And in today's video, first of all, I will show you where we are on the price chart and how we get there. Then I will continue with the fundamental news so that might drive the price of this company. And at the end of this video, I will share my thoughts and my technical analysis. And I will show you what should we expect next. And before we get into all of that, if you guys would like to earn two free stocks with Mumu valued up to $7,000, please check out that link in the description below. All you have to do is sign up for an account and deposit as little as $1. This is guaranteed free money. Full details you can see on the screen right now. So let's start with the price chart. I made my previous video right here at this point uh, and I've told you that we had a very good bounce uh, from its uh, lowest point, uh, the range of about $7.78 was a very good uh, range uh, from which we had this V-shape correction and uh, for now I have to say that uh, we have a lot of signs that this is the real bottom of the price action uh, for the long period of time. And uh, for now, as you can see, we have uh, this sideways movement. We didn't break uh, neither this range of roughly $10 uh, as a resistance, uh, nor this range uh, that is $9.3 as a support. And for now, we are nearing this range again, and uh, most likely we will see the lower price action, but it is totally okay, because it is 100% corresponds with my analysis. And I will show you my technical analysis in just several minutes, and for now, let's continue with the fundamental news. First of all, Let's start with this one, and the, I have to say it is quite bearish news. It was published uh, on uh, CNBC.com on March 23rd, and it's titled Higher Education Expert Proposes a New Way for Biden to Cancel Student Debt Without Congress. And the key points are following. Democrats and advocates uh, have called on President Joe Biden to cancel student uh, debt via executive order. Yet, there might be another way uh, the White House can cancel student debt without passing legislation, according to a recent analysis uh, by higher education expert Mark uh, Kantrowitz. And let me quote you this. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer of New York and Senator Elizabeth Warren, DMS, are among those calling on President Joe Biden to bypass Congress and forgive student debt through executive order. And definitely this might be the negative sign for SoFi, because SoFi has about 20% of its revenue from student loan refinancing and definitely it might affect the, the fundamentals of this company. But let me show you what Anthony Nota said. And right here on Yahoo Finance uh, on uh, March 22nd, uh, he calls on Biden administration to raise $10,000 for borrowers. And I will put the link on this uh, article and you might watch uh, this video by yourself. And the main idea that uh, there is uh, three types uh, of uh, borrowers. First of all, those uh, who are almost broke and they cannot sustain any sources of income uh, to pay their bills. And there are not so many people uh, like this, and that's why uh, the total forgiveness of uh, the student loans uh, is not 100% uh, healthy for economy. Second type of borrowers, those who want uh, more clarification in upcoming years, because they have to plan their future and they have to know exactly how much uh, they should uh, pay, and these people they basically don't need $10,000 uh, to repair their loans. They just uh, need more clarification in upcoming uh, years. And the third part of borrowers is those uh, who basically don't need any money at all and uh, they can pay their student loans uh, in any cases uh, and uh, in any circumstances. That's why, let me show you that Anthony Noto posted uh, this tweet and he wrote, please don't just uh, hit reply and comment until you watch uh, this uh, interview to get educated on why Mr. Joe Biden must lead from the front and avoid spending an unnecessary $60 billion of taxpayers' money on top of the $150 billion already invested. The $60 billion uh, must go to real needs uh, versus a free lunch. And I completely agree with his statement. And even previously, on uh, March the 17th, on their official website they posted this article and uh, it's titled Our Recommendation for President Biden. And right here you can read this uh, recommendation by yourself. And I have to say that it is a very good proposal for Mr. Joe Biden. And I have to say that it is more, much more healthy for the economy in general. So, and let's continue with some positive news uh, directly related to SoFi company. On the March 22nd, we have this article on Yahoo Finance and it says Galileo accelerates Latin American growth with expansion into Colombia. 
And let me quote you this. Galileo Financial Technologies, a subsidiary of Sofia Technologies Incorporated, today announced its recent expansion into Colombia. Galileo is currently providing services in Colombia where it can partner with issuers, banks, e-commerce and fintechs to enable their digital financial services offerings. And definitely this expansion on new territory will increase their financials and uh, will uh, be more beneficial in the long term uh, for SoFi and definitely it will push uh, the price uh, of SoFi stock even higher in the long term. Next news and uh, it was published uh, on uh, March 22nd as well and it says SoFi launches no fee cryptocurrency purchase for direct deposit members and let me quote you this. SoFi, the digital personal finance company, today announced members will uh, now be able to invest part of every direct de deposit uh, into cryptocurrency with zero fees. This feature builds uh, on SoFi's robust offerings uh, for checking and savings accounts, which already includes no account uh, or overdraft fees, up uh, to two-day early paycheck and uh, an industry-leading 1% annual percentage yield. Members will be able to set a recurrent purchase uh, for the cryptocurrency of their choice with each uh, paycheck for no purchase fee. Investing either by dollar amount or percentage of their deposit into one of 30 coins. This feature is currently live uh, to all members with both a SoFi Invest crypto account and SoFi checking and savings account. Crypto investing is rising rapidly. In the last year alone, SoFi doubt the number of investors setting up automatic uh, recurrent crypto purchases, said Anthony Nota, CEO of SoFi. By adding the ability for members to automate uh, crypto purchases right from their paycheck, we are making it uh, easier than ever for our members to customize how they manage their spending, savings and investing all in one place to help them get their money right. And definitely it is a very good uh, step uh, for their product because uh, a lot of people might uh, make uh, this type of investment uh, just uh, as a weekly or monthly recurring payment. And definitely it is a very good step. So, and let's continue with the technical analysis. But before we dive deep right here, please subscribe to my channel, hit notification bell and hit the like button. This helps me a lot. So guys, uh, as I already mentioned in my previous video, it is very tricky to make any breakdown according to Elliott Wave theory of uh, this movement. I barely see three waves out of five. And uh, technically we have to see one more leg to the downside, then collect more steam and hit higher targets. And if it is the case, uh, the ranges are still the same. And uh, you can uh, mark these ranges by pulling the Fibonacci retracement tool from uh, this uh, bottom to this top. And we can adjust this tool a little bit. And we have following levels uh, to accumulate the position. It is 0.382 Fibonacci retracement level at the price point of $9.16. Next one is $8.89. And the golden pocket range, uh, the range in between $8.5 and $8.6. And it is the confluence with this uh, yellow line, the previous swing low. And uh, definitely from uh, these ranges we might have a trend reversal and we might hit higher targets. And on a bigger picture, let me switch to daily time frame. The price target uh, for this asset is still the same. It is the golden pocket range. If I pull the Fibonacci retracement tool from this top uh, to this uh, bottom, we have uh, the 0.65 and 0.618 Fibonacci ranges as the most probable range where we might have uh, some kind of reaction or even trend reversal. This means uh, in a medium term perspective, this range uh, might be our next price target. And from our current price, we might have uh, up to 90%, 96% uh, to this range as a potential profits. So, I think from a technical standpoint that's it for now. If you like my video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel with the notification bell. And see you guys and girls next time. Bye!